Welcome back to Grizz Vision here on Grizz TV. My name is Neil Rule. We're here with head soccer coach Eric Pogue and Austin Ricci after a nil-nil draw against the number 18 team in the country, the Louisville Cardinals. And Austin, we'll start with you. Uh, Louisville seemed to have their way a little bit in terms of the first half of this game. They had a lot of high-quality chances. You came into the game and, and really stemmed the tide. You created a couple of very, very brilliant chances, nearly converted on them. Talked about you know what went right for you when you checked into the game. Uh, before I came in, I was on the sideline watching, uh, and their wide guys were getting behind our wide guys, and our they were doubling up on our outside backs, and they were finding splits. And then I came in, and I tried to just drop and try and limit the passes out to that wide guy so he wouldn't get as much chances or even time on the ball or anything. And, and you, obviously, with a couple of very golden chances to score in this game, unable to finish on those. But, hey, it is a preseason. What's your impressions of facing the number 18 team in the country here and getting a result? Uh, it's good to play against teams like this because it's more exciting. Like It's more competitive. If you're going to play teams that we're just going to pass the ball around, they're not going to pressure us, not going to give us a challenge, and it's not... It's not really going to help us, so playing teams like this help us step our game up and become more successful for the season. All right, awesome. Thank you very much. Appreciate the time. We'll move over to head coach Eric Pogue. And, Coach, I'll pose that same question to you. The number 18 team in the country rolls into Rochester. You guys get a result, and it wasn't what you wanted when you faced off against Akron, but you really circled the wagons here tonight. Yeah, I mean, the the guys' effort was uh, fantastic tonight. It's night and day compared to the Akron game, and, um, you know, but I think we kind of had to go through what we did at Akron and, and get exposed a little bit and to get the guys to buy into, you know, what we need to do to be successful, and, and that's the formula tonight. It's uh, team defending, um, you know, on the break. Uh, I think Austin talked a little bit about what a good job he did defending, but that tr that translated into him getting ahead of steam going forward and creating a bunch of chances, and, uh, you know, that was the MO for us being successful last year, and, you know, we got a large core nucleus of those same guys here, and, and the formula doesn't change and uh, you know sometimes uh, we got to kick the summer soccer out of them a little bit and uh, you know get them back to what we're doing here at Oakland and I'm not saying what doesn't work in their summer teams but we're talking about Oakland University now and um, you know we need the whole team to buy into the philosophy that works for us to be successful. And coach you speak of the process you get a quick turnaround here Monday night Saginaw Valley rolling into town a division two power an old friend of yours uh, at yeah. the helm as well and Andy Wagstaff but Hey, you know, you do this for a reason, another simulated game condition, two games and three nights, and that's what you face in the season, so that's what you replicate in the preseason. Yeah, I mean, uh, the first couple weekends of the season, we're doing uh, basically two games in three days, uh, so that's that's really why we did this. And, uh, you know, Saginaw Valley State is, you know, one of the, the premier Division two programs in the country, and obviously uh, with Andy coming back, uh, there's a little bit more... Um, to the game and we're excited for him to come back he was a huge part of the success of this team and the guys that are on this field and you know we're, we're really uh, happy for him and what he's doing and I know he's excited to come back and uh, and, and face off against us and uh, yeah it's another opportunity for you know a lot of guys logged a lot of minutes tonight and uh, so there's a lot of guys that maybe didn't get as many minutes that'll get an opportunity to showcase themselves and uh, you know it's one more prep game uh, to get ready for Western Illinois next Friday night. All right, Coach, certainly do appreciate the time. Congrats on the result, and uh, we'll see you on Monday night. Okay, appreciate it. Thank you.